Goa too will reduce the quantum of fines under the amended Motor Vehicle Act. However, the Transport Minister Movin Gudino is categorical in saying that he will not compromise on traffic discipline and this would be strictly ensured. Here are the details. The Transport Minister was speaking after the news of Gujarat government reducing the fines as per the newly amended Motor Vehicle Act. He however says that implementation will only be in the month of January next year. Sir, this issue of these traffic uh, fines has, has, been, has been reverberating all over, not only in the state, in the country also. Now, Gujarat has reduced uh, the number of, uh, the amount of fines in some cases. So, what is the Goa uh, government doing? The Central Motor Vehicles Act has been uh, uh, amended. We are supposed to follow the Central Act in letter and spirit. But I want to say one thing, that there are two parts to this. One is in uh, uh, certain uh, sections of violations we have no power like drunken driving driving without license whatever the increase in fine that has been levied by uh, the central act we will have to go by that whereas there are other offenses wherein we have the leverage to reduce the quantum of fine that is being imposed on our uh, traffic violators or people using the roads we will be doing it and adopting a sort of model which will not be too harsh to the people of Goa. At the same time, I want traffic discipline. I want total discipline on the road. Somebody cannot get drunk and put other people's life at risk. He is like a bomb waiting to burst. He is totally drunk and he goes and smashes a few other people on the bike and even other motor vehicles. Naturally, he is like a bomb, he is out to kill others. This cannot be tolerated. But at the same time, if you are going to fine people so heavily for merely not wearing a helmet, which of course I recommend very strongly they should wear a helmet to protect their life. But such violations, we can uh, uh, slightly reduce the quantum of fine. If you are going to be a traffic violator, you will have to pay through your nose. You will have to pay very heavily. We will not compromise discipline that you have to observe by, uh, by observing the traffic rules and coming on the road. This is something what we are going to educate the people. Implementing the central uh, uh, rules, it will happen only I think by in the new year. That is at least my assessment as a member of the cabinet. I will also discuss this further with my Honorable Chief Minister Dr. Pramod Savan and take a final call. No helmet and seat belt. Central rates are thousand rupees while in Gujarat it is 500 obstructing fire brigade and ambulance in central it is 10,000 and Gujarat just thousand rupees triple riding on a two-wheeler central thousand rupees and in Gujarat hundred rupees wrong side driving centrals settled in court while Gujarat on the spot fine no PUC certificate by central the fine is 10,000 rupees and in Gujarat just 3,000 rupees no change in Gujarat for Drunken driving 10,000 rupees. Under 18 driving 25,000 rupees. Jumping a traffic light 5,000 rupees. However, it was also quite upfront in saying that there was no way he would implement near the new fines as long as the road improvement was not done. I am not in a hurry to implement the Central Act. Is I think morally we are responsible. It is a collective responsibility. Looking at the pathetic condition of the roads with so many potholes everywhere you literally cannot ride or drive as against such a situation how can you punish your citizens for and call them violators of uh, different traffic rules it's not fair so we will not think of implementing uh, the new fines or the new rate of fines until we repair the road which i expect to be over by November end or uh, by December, the latest. Former Transport Minister Sudin Davlikar, however, is of the opinion that the state government has to implement the amendments to the Motor Vehicle Act and he is not agreeable with the Gujarat fine reduction. He also speaks on children riding and driving. Watch him. Sagrayat Mahatwaji Ghost is amendment of act, the Transport Motor Vehicle Act. Does. Her act Fatlia government done Mukharkello. And in Yakatirus, how Puini Minje, how as a member Tavara Velo Tajo Rubber, how Taje, Mandi Pandabrada Narindi Modiche, 
आणि सगळ्या कॅबिनेट मिनिस्टरांचे अभिनंदन करता लोकसभेचे मेंबरांचे अभिनंदन करता आणि राज्यसभेचे मेंबर अभिनंदन कारण राज्यसभेत फाटल्या फावटी स्क्रि स्क्रिनिंग कमिटीक केलं आहे आणि ह्या फावटी ते डायरेक्ट पास झालं आहे आणि त्या खातीरच भारतातल्या सात स्टेटींनी इमिजिएट हो ॲक्ट इम्प्लिमेंट करपा हातात घेतला आहे पण दुःख मला असे दिसले की आमचं मुख्यमंत्री आणि जो ट्रान्सपोर्ट मिनिस्टर असा ताणी सांगले की डिसेंबरात हो ॲक्ट करपा जाय जे सरकार भारतात माननीय भारतीय जनता पक्ष नरेंद्र मोदीच्या सकल असा आणि त्यांनी हो ॲक्ट मोठं त्रास करून पास केला तो इमेजेट गोयात जावपा जाय पहिली म्हणजे कायद्यात असे असा की अठरा वर्ष सकलल्या भुरग्याक मोटरसायकल काढून दिवची नाही हे असा की ना सो इज इट नॉट द मिस्टेक ऑफ द पॅरंट्स टू बी मदर ऑर फादर टू गिव्ह मोटरसायकल ऑर स्कूटर टूनल एग्री जाता वेर इज द क्वेशन नेक्स्ट कम नेक्स्ट केन्ना जाता जेन्ना तुका गाडी दिता तेन्ना येता येते म्हाका मानले ना म्हजे भुरगे आसा म्हाका दोन भुरगे हांवें केन्नाच केलं ना आय वॉज कॅपेबल Our chief reporter Glenn Costa with videos journalist Irshad Sheikh and Amar Chawria in Panachi